Hi guys, this is Tracy. I'm going to show you how to ungroup and attach some of the elements from your garden Subway Art Free SVG to make it easier when it comes time to cut your vinyl. So first thing, let's make our screen a little smaller here. I am going to ungroup all this. So you can either right click and hit ungroup or you can come up here where it says ungroup. And I am just going to keep ungrouping here. This flower section, I know I'm not going to ungroup, so I'm actually going to hide that. And I will explain that why in a little bit. Okay, so this little bee here, we're going to ungroup. And then we need to actually ungroup the bee itself. Okay, and that yellow, we're going to hide that part there. This bee here, let's ungroup this one. Same with this little guy. And then we're gonna hide that yellow. Ladybugs, let's ungroup them. And this little guy, I'm gonna hide that whole thing all together. And again, I'll explain that why in a second. Ungroup this. this dash line here we are going to hide. Okay, everything that's left here, this is the uh, all black. This is basically the bottom layer that you can lay down first. So we're going to highlight all of this down to the bottom right where it says attach and we're going to attach all of that together. Okay, now we're going to start bringing elements back in. Okay, we're going to bring in the ladybugs and the reason that I did not attach the bottom the, the black bodies from the ladybugs. When you go to make this, if you have um, all the black laid down first, it's going to be really difficult to get your red on because this black is actually laying on top of this red. And I will show you what I mean here if I can. Let's see. Let me do a duplicate so you can see what I mean. If I ungroup this, this red is actually laying down first, and then this black is going to go on top of it. So if you have the black down first, it would be impossible to get your red back. You would have to slice all that out and put it on top. So that's why I did it that way. So I hope that explains the, the thought process in my brain as I'm trying to explain this. Now with your bees, um, let's bring these back. There's the yellow and the other yellow, which actually need to be brought to the front now. So I'm going to click that. It doesn't need to be for cutting purposes, just for me to show you. And then we're going to send to the front. Okay. So the flowers, the whole group of flowers, I am not going to untouch any of, um, ungroup any of that or attach any of it because same thing with the ladybugs. The flower colors need to be underneath the black. So you don't want to attach this black to anything else because that's going to have to be laid on top. So the flowers we're going to leave alone. And the one little dash thing here from the bee flying, that one also is not going to get attached because it's laying on top of a color. So that is also going to be cut separate. So now when we go to make it, larger mat, the 12 by 24 mat, but you can see that all of this right here is going to cut together. And then these are your separate pieces. All your red. And if you are not sure how to move designs, you can actually take this. Actually, I'm going to move it out of the way first so that it lands in a separate spot. Click on your dots, move object here. There he is. And then move it down so you make sure it's out of the way. Okay. And then when you line up your vinyl on your, on your mats, just make sure that you have them within the borders that you need. All right. Hope that helps you guys. Have a great day.